Hello and welcome to Let's Play The Simpsons Hit and Rum with me, Mr. McCluckable. In the last episode, we collected the remaining gags and wasps of Apu's level so we could get enough coins to do the next two story missions. And well, would you look at that? Now we have 1,035 coins. Like I said at the end of the last episode, I, uh, I went around and collected up a tad more coins because we, we just weren't there with the amount necessary. 925. I've went a bit over, but you know, I might get hit and run a few times, so better to be safe. Uh, so we're back here at the hospital with uh, Dr. Hibbert to do these uh, story missions. Now, I'm going to say this. I just had a little practice run of them. They do get difficult now. They do get a little bit tricky. So don't be surprised if I fail miserably and have to cut forward. Anyway, let's go. Hello, Dr. Hibbert. Don't laugh at me. I'm afraid we have a medical emergency. <gasps> oh no, my babies. Your babies are about to go to the bathroom all over my waiting room. And diapers aren't covered by your insurance. Ooh, you better hurry. I heard the parents of the Shelbyville Nine are grabbing every diaper in town. I will get the diapers, but there's no way I could fit them in my car. Maybe Mr. Homer will have a large gas-guzzling American vehicle that I could use. <sighs> Here we go. To complete this mission, you will need Homer's custom-built car. Purchase it from Homer in the hospital parking lot for 500 coins. Uh, or call it if you already own it. Well, we don't. That's why I need to get all these damn coins. Because it costs 500. But. But. It is a good car. It is a good vehicle. It's funny. I like it. Here we go. Hello, Homer. Mr. Homer, sir. Do you have an oversized vehicle that I might be borrowing? Borrowing? No. Selling to you at an insanely high price? Yes. Fine, whatever. <laughs> I like a poo's little dance there in the middle of a conversation, just to spice things up. Here we go, car built for Homer. Let's have a quick look at its stats. Very, very, very fast. Nice acceleration. It's it's quite good all round, really. Except it's 500 coins. Oh, look at that deplete. Oh no. Here we go. Eight is too much. Hit the Shelbyville van and collect the diapers or nappies if we're in England before time runs out. Just want to be a bit equal, you know. Right, here we go. This, this, um... This mission is, is quite deceiving, because it's like, oh, only ten. That's okay. But this, this Shelbyville van, with children in it, I might add, I'm sure, or is that just bags? Either way, it drives too fast. And it weaves all over the place. And I, I was quite lucky last time, I, I managed to get it stuck in a corner. You know, that glitchy AI... Oh, did I hit it twice then? I guess I did. That glitchy AI that always happens with me, because I'm ever so lucky. But, um... Yeah, I did have to redo it a few times. Oh, damn. Luckily, it doesn't stray too far away from um, the hospital, which is where you need to go back to, to sort the, uh, the children out. I say, get stuck in this corner. Excellent. No. No, 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 no. Oh, fine. So uh, it just kind of circles around the park bit a little bit, and uh, don't drive into that tree. So we should be good. The mission's after this, though. Oof, oof, no, no, no. Do not like the looks of them, to be honest with you. And I've nearly got hit and run. What did I say? Getting the extra coins, because just in case. Thank goodness you ran out of the way, old man. One more, come on. One more in 14 seconds. There we go. Oh, and we're right near the hospital as well. That went better than expected there. Very pleased. Just don't get hit and run now. Ooh. Hopefully that dial should go down when we finish talking to Dr. Hibbert. Let's see. Quickly, cover my incontinent children's tushies. <laughs> that was close. Another minute in my office would look like the Ganges River. Uh, and yes, it did. Excelente. Oh, I think we just saw the inside of Dr. Hibbert's head there. That was not a nice sight. Okay, that's one mission down. 500 coins for that. Just for that. I hate this game. <laughs> um, next, we're going to do the next story mission. In today's episode, I I don't think we're going to get a Pooh's level completed 100% in five episodes. I was very worried about that. Um, so that means I want to get a lot done in this episode. Including this mission here. Maybe even the race. Maybe even the bonus mission. We'll see. Hello, Krusty. Talk to me, please. Hello, famous American clown. 
I wish to ask a favor. Everyone wants to wet their beaks. Ugh. I require information about trucks delivering evil cola. How can I get this classified data? Sorry, Apu. I'm a drink squeezy, punchy lowlife. You need a professional scumbag. Follow a cop until you find one. You'll have better luck if you, you know, look American. Thank you, horrible man. Okay, you need a disguise. Purchase Apu's American clothes at Moe's or the DMV for 425 coins. Sure thing. Menu screen. We're going to quickly drive to Moe's Inn and spend 425 more coins, leaving us with practically nothing. <sighs> Just for a stupid costume with a... Oh, mind you, it does have the, uh, the very nice hat with the camera in it. I think that's the same hat from... Um, the episode Homer and a Pooh, which I mentioned last episode as well. Let's have a look. Oh great, the music. Mm, love it. Here we go. Hey Mo. Right, we have a few to choose from. Well, not for this mission, but we have Army, which looks quite cool. I like that. American, which is what we need. And also the B-Sharps. Notice that is 475 coins. I'm going to need to find that from somewhere. <laughs> anyway, stop moaning. Here we go. American. Is it the... Is it... No, it's not. Oh, I thought it was the giant hat with the camera in it. Oh. Oh, well. It's a bit of a shame, actually. It should be. Now I need to go back to the Krusty Burger. Oh, and also... um. Oh, should I get them now? No. No, I'll leave it till the end. I did also want to collect up the last two uh, collector cards, because I do know where they are. In fact, I walked straight past one last episode, which was pretty foolish of me. So we'll hopefully get them towards the end as well, very, very quickly. Uh, look at your new outfit in the window. Or glass, or whatever that said. Oh, like we did with Marge. Okay. This little piggy. Follow the police to find a criminal. Ah, oh, yes. Now this... Oh, this mission did scare me a little bit. Oh no, forward, 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 not back. You have a very, very, very harsh time limit here. Um, if you crash, basically, you need to restart. Because um, I, I always do this with about maybe six seconds left. And that's with very good driving, might I add. <laughs> so, yeah, and there's this bit in here, which I really don't like. It's um, weaving. I hate this bit of the map anyway, but doing that, oh dear, is definitely no good. Minute to collect 25 things. Now they're all very close together, yeah that's fine, but it's the traffic that you worry about. Now we need to get to the police station, good bit, following Jeep Wiggum. Uh, I think we've done it. Yeah, we're okay actually, maybe it was not as harsh as I thought, but it's still a bit mean. Okay, here's Chief Wiggum. This bit is sneaky, because he kind of does a few little unnecessary trips. Like, he's going to go around here. doesn't need to. He's going to come out round here. Because you save yourself the bother. Stay on this side, because he's going to turn around the corner any second now. Uh, it's when he gets on the motorway, the highway, that it gets a little bit tricky. And also, um, hit and run. I got a lot of hit and run when I practiced in this mission. Actually, I did have hit and run on me, but I managed to escape them. The pro skills of Muckluck on this game. Incredible. No, not really. Uh, we're, we're actually travelling to the DMV because... Uh, <laughs> no. The next mission after this is probably one of the most difficult, if not the most difficult game uh, mission in the game. A lot of people think this. Um, oh no. Oh no. Oh, dodged all that. Uh, it's called Never Trust a Snake. And believe me, it is so difficult. So difficult. Mainly because it's smashing up all the cars in the way. Mainly because you need to be... You need to practice it over and over and over again to get the quickest possible route. It's basically a collectathon, chase, race, time, whatever mission. Oh, we did that. We did that quite easily, actually. I'm impressed. And I was talking at the same time. I did that worse, just on my own. Yeah, I'm not talking to you, Snake. Screw you. Your mission's an evil, evil mission. Go away. Instead... Hmm, I think it's time. I'm not going to look out. I think it's time to tackle the bonus mission, which is back at the hospital. So I will cut forward and see you there. 
Okay, we're here back at the hospital. We're actually, it's not actually in the hospital, it's at the Java server. I think that's what this shop's called, isn't it? Yeah, the grand opening as well. Now, before we talk to Professor Frink, we're going to change cars because the bonus mission involves um, Smashy Smashy. And I think I stuck with the police car in my little practice go because it's a nice all rounder, it's quick and it's still quite tough. And also what I'm going to do is this. This is very mean, this mission, because it sets the timer as soon as you press start. So, I'm going to position my car ready. This is this is planning here. So, that should be in the right position. Let's go. Excuse me, nice Mr. Shopkeeper person. Have you seen a hovering death machine? No, nothing specifically of the hovering kind, no. Oh, <laughs> This was to be my greatest invention since sideburns in a can. They make you handsome and lovely. What are you talking about? I call it the Hover Car TM, so don't try to steal the name, it's TM'd. I installed the onboard computer, and it came alive and attacked my person. For the love of all that's gliding, you gotta help me here. Okay, what on earth can I do? Knock the flishigging the thing off the road before the authorities come and take me away again. Prisons ain't kind to pencil neck geeks like myself. They they stomp and they kick. Oh, maybe he's had some experience with prisons before then. Kinky Frinky, ooh uh, find and disable the hover car before time runs out. Right, get in there now. Here we go. See, look, no time wasted. Oh, hang on, he's got kind of a bit stuck by the. Ooh. Oh, that was quite lucky. Now I was incredibly lucky last time. He managed to get stuck again. again. Um, that was after about three or four tries. So, I guess it's just, like, at the end of the day, probability that, oh, at some point, however, however many times you do try this mission, it is going to fail at some point. Um, the AI, that is. Oh, that was a nice whack there. Um, this is going not too bad. I had to... Last time, I, I think I drove all the way to... Um, well, the other side of the map, basically, and I, I think I failed in the end. I got here and run or something. Uh, but this mission is, is really quite tough. It's very fast. It does that thing where it's very fast when you're near it, and very slow when it gets too far ahead. Um, in fact, I've kind of lost it now. Why? Why? Come on. Right. All I needed to do... It's got to go around this shortcut, isn't it? Yeah. All I needed to do is get stuck somewhere. Come on, you're my friend, game. Have more glitch ups. Oh my goodness me, what's happened? Where's it gone? Oh, there it is. Yep, it's the hover car. I think we saw this one time before. I think we raced it, actually. Oh no, I'm gonna get hit and run. Thank goodness I'm on the highway. Um, yeah, I think we did race it before, at some point in the game, I'm pretty sure. And it was just as evil then as it is now. Oh no! Oh, it's kind of doing its job for me. Or my job for itself. There we go, there we go. Come on, we're close now. Although we do have to drive back to the server. And last time it got stuck right near the hospital, so <laughs> that was good for me. Uh, it's almost dead. Oh, that car's dead. Wrong car! But we do need to get back very quickly. I wonder how much time they give you to get back. I wonder if it's the same every time. Oh, 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 here we go. Drive back to the Java server in 1 minute 22. That should be doable if I know where I'm driving. And it is this way. Good. I really don't want to smash up though. I should have got that spanner. Ooh. Anyway, I think this mission's gone fairly well. I think this whole episode's gone quite well to begin with. However, we still have a race to do yet. And I still need to get back to this Java server. I'm driving very carefully for once. Something I don't usually do. Uh, which way is it? No, don't get hit and run now. They will smash me up. We've done it. It's only over here. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Talk to Professor Frink. We helped your car by smashing it up. Great work, my Hindu friend. Ugh, do not patronize my faith, okay? Sorry. Terribly sorry. Uh, look, if you need a ride, instant message my cortex. By which I mean, call me. <laughs> I'm... Bonus mission complete, and we now get the hover car. We've unlocked it, and we can go to the phone booth to use it. Except I'm not, because I don't really care. 
Okay, no, I'm not, I'm not talking to Snake. You heard me, game. That mission's too difficult. I need to practice it first. Um, alright, how much time we got left? We've got a little bit of time left. Let's try the race. Let's try it. I think it's near Moe's, so I'll meet you. With, oh, I jumped over that damn spanner. I'll meet you near Moe's um, for... Oh, we're here. <laughs> Hello again. It should be Millhouse right over here. It is. Although, should I change vehicle? I probably should. Let's change vehicle quickly. Let's change it for... Yeah, just a Longhorn. Keep it simple. Keep it simple, stupid. Um, I think it's going to be a time trial, actually. So that shouldn't be too difficult. If I can actually find where Milhouse has gone, over here. I think it's just going to be a simple lap around somewhere. A few times. Hello, little customer. Are you here to help me in some fashion? Your nachos have hair in them. The hair is your protein. Okay. Well, you have to race now. Is there actually protein in hair? I don't know. Uh, race 1, time trial. Cross the finish line. Before time runs out, don't destroy your vehicle. Race it is indeed. Five laps. It must be very short then. If I only get 1 minute 20. Oh, I think I know. Oh! Oh, I hate those bumps in the ground. Okay, I think I know what it's going to be. Can I stick on this side, mate? Oh, you damn lamppost. Oh, right. I see what this is. So, very, very short lap. I'll probably fast forward, see how I do. See you in a bit. Okay, Dapu, you've qualified for your license. Big deal. You still work at a convenience store. Oh, we've done it. We've unlocked all the races. Go to a phone booth to get the El Caro Loco. I don't know what that is. Let's have a quick look. Uh, I'm interested. Where is the phone booth? It's over there. The only thing to do now to complete my goals for this episode is to get the last two cards, which hopefully I'll be able to do. Let's just have a quick look at the El Caro Loco. If I can find it. Ah, oh, there we go. Hmm. Not bad. Looks nice. Very nice. I'm going to use this to drive to the next two cars. Uh, I think we're okay for time. Joe, you know what? I don't care. The first one. Oh, look. It's even got like a little uh, light on the bottom. Very nice. First card that I missed is down here near the legitimate social business club thing. Grab that. And also a crate. It is the Pin Pal shirt. Let's just get this crate because uh, this would have been very handy last episode. Let's have a quick look. Um, This one. From the episode Team Homer, the shirt worn by Homer's bowling team, Homer, Mo, Apu, and unfortunately, Mr. Burns. There we go. Right, the, the last card is somewhere on the highway, over a jump, so I'll see you there. Okay, I've found it, finally. I've just spent ages looking for this damn... I've, I've, I've saw the card, I could not find where to get the right jump from. Now, if we hug the left side of this jump... There we go! Collect a card. Ganesh costume. Level cards collected. Have a quick look. Uh, Ganesh. Ganesh. From the episode, the two Mr. Uh, the two Mrs. Nahasapuma Petalons, worn by Homer, in a vain last minute attempt to halt the arranged marriage ceremony of a Pooh and Mandula. Where he eats all the peanuts. Anyway, there we go. Wow, we actually did everything I planned to in that episode. I'm so pleased. Next episode, we're going to carry on with the story missions, try to do that very difficult mission, never trust a snake, wish me luck on that. So until then, thank you for watching, and goodbye.